What's going on guys? Um, we are five weeks probably since I've last picked up the GoPro. Uh, the, the last video, I know it came out last week, but it was done um, just before or just after the fight. So time to get some new stuff done now, get the ball rolling again. Um, today, well we're a week now since the gyms have opened back up in Wales, which we're very happy about. Uh, you're in Avatilleri. So we're going to give you a little insight into um, Tuesday night's class at, at Show MMA with our Thai coach, Crew Heem. Um, just finished this morning hour, I did a little run and um, a personal training session with him, just a one-to-one, -one, some pad work, some technique. So we're going to do some filming tonight of, you're going to see a little bit into the kids' class and obviously try and get some footage then of, of the actual class itself. So keep tuned in, hopefully you enjoy it and... Um, Hopefully you enjoy seeing the mats full as much as I do, rather than uh, rather than this behind uh, closed door stuff. So we shall check in now at about five o'clock. Right, we've been back over another week, um, been really busy, numbers are starting to come back in. You know, we lost a lot of trade over the last 12 months and that's understandable with the lockdown, uh, people out of work and whatnot. But yeah, um, fingers crossed, we're in the right direction, a few more restrictions be lifted in a few weeks and uh, hopefully by the summer we see everything back to normal, fingers crossed. We've had um, lots of inquiries about new members starting, but what we've done for me Showed a bit of loyalty to the people that have um, supported the gym during the lockdown, so we've taken no new members on at all. But from June the 1st, we'll be taking on uh, you know, new guys for the MMA packages. So if anybody is interested in joining the team, uh, drop us an email or, or send a Facebook page message. Um, back now, four weeks since Jack last fought. Uh, a tough old trip out there, you know, even with the isolation and with us not being able to move around. But, um, it's tough as fight the date, we knew that going into it, but I think he shone in all areas um, and really showed you know, the American audience, which is an important thing with USC, that you know, the British lads can wrestle and when he's dominated a, a, a really high level American wrestler. So, brilliant result. For me, that's his best win to date and I think that'll propel him onto a, the next level now when we start matching up uh, for around about August. The travel. Sunday, me and Carl Park, I travel up Sunday to join Brett, who's already gone out just to acclimatise a bit out in America. Um, he's got his first fight on his Bellator contract, really tough opponent, um, two losses the guys had, and that's against Peter Yan, who's the current, or was the current world champion until he got disqualified at the UFC, and uh, a, a, another high level UFC guy. Brett is on fire at the moment, I think you'll see that his game has gone up level after level, I think him and Jack trained it together has, has improved, improved both of them greatly. Um, but I'm looking forward to it. It'll be my first experience as a coach um, competing in Bellator, and we couldn't have a better person to represent the team, really, and Brett doing it. Um, fingers crossed we have a good win, and I'd like to think Bellator will be looking to you know, match Brett for the title in the next, cu next couple of fights, really. I, I think good win year, one more, and he should be knocking on door for the title challenge. Jack Cross, follow through with the right elbow.
slam forward again, go this time, we need the right elbow, yeah? Get up, you go slow this in, strike, half second, walk through, single position, strike, land in, boom. And then nice simple, but in real, try to go nice and speed, so you go, tuck this in, boom, boom. Again, pad man, learn how to feed the gap. Yeah, don't stay where you are, yeah? And also look when you knee or strike, or stop the strike. Body stand up tall, okay? So back, bang, sit up to south, walk in when you knee, not important. A lot of you go like this, drop your straight knee down. So drop knee down, stand up tall, draw your forward, boom, in there, land, boom, bring the elbow. Hemo Thai coach comes up every Tuesday. Um, private sessions in the day with all the fighters, and then also does the pass in the night. He um, used to be the head Thai coach at AKA Thailand, so one of the biggest gyms in Thailand. El Patrick, like Mark Hunt, um, Thai Tuavaza, Mike Sweat, lots of UFC guys. So really lucky, really, to have him here. Um, he lives in Harryford, that's why we can only have once a week. But very, very good coach, one of the best I've ever worked with. And now you can see that in all the boys' games, you know, in the strike in, like Josh Reed's last fight, not knock out with a knee on the clinch. So he's, uh, he's just been a real asset to the team, and now we're back open, we're, we're glad to have him back. This is the true idea thing, okay? Normally they're gonna do it, happen. Sit down, you're coming, bang, bang, from there, got solid burn, bang, jumping straight away. Okay, nice, simple, yeah, see? You're coming. This pad man need to walk in, come in, and then to jump the yeah, nine seven. And try to land the ball on, okay? Look, good work, yeah? Good. Now, you know more, yeah? Oh, nice, good. Boom. Come back, yeah, nine simple, yeah? Hit the nine simple, see today, good? Yes, boom, nine. What is jab, yeah? Hit jab, not jab. Hit, yeah? Step in, attack, boom, and come out. Boom, and come out, and go back, strike, boom, and then down, okay? Alright guys, that's the day done then. Um, hope you enjoyed another episode in the books. Don't forget to like, share and subscribe. Um, plenty coming up, so we'll get some more videos and some more content done for you soon. And um, stay safe and we shall see you next time.